Hello guys and welcome back to another episode of Colonial's Program. If you haven't watched my Grand Casino Tycoon episode, you don't know where that hello is from because that is like stuck in my head guys. If you want to check it out, it's on my channel actually. Yeah, Grand Casino Tycoon, that hello guys is so stuck in my head. Anyways, we want to get started with today's episode of Colonial's Program, fellas. What we will do is, I think we, will, we are like the final level. I don't know again because I don't know. Uh, I haven't played the game completely through. But yeah, I want to see what this is. This is obviously Lura, where we started from, well, where our Mimi and the other robot started from. We're going to get into this episode immediately, guys. We want to get into it, see what's uh, going to happen, because we have to get like six colonists, one tier three rocket, clear all terrain, and within 25 minutes as well. Now, that's going to be some doing. Uh, it's a medium-sized planet, as you can see. Uh, resources adequate, difficulty hard. Ooh, homeland of humans. Now that is going to be interesting. Uh, but before we get started, guys, just a small reminder for you guys to remember to subscribe to my channel. Leave a like on this video and comment and let me know what you guys thought of the entire series. If it's the last one, obviously, because I don't know, guys. I don't know. So we'll get started immediately. Before we do that, guys, before we launch into this uh, thingy, uh, this planet, I'm going to go over to here. Uh, because we have, like, one more crits or whatever this is. Uh, which means we can say, what does this do? Uh, it does show us, right? I think it did. Uh, okay, yeah, there we go. Increases air core, air core resource grid range, which is very good. Increases supply gain per colonist. Ooh, interesting. Increases air uh, air produces home, which I don't think I want. I, I think I want to go for the networking one. Yeah, let's go for this one. Uh, okay, so I'm hoping this will really help us out. Let's go back. Let's launch our mission over here. Obviously, there's going to be some sort of a dialogue. Let's see what this says. This is Planet Lura, homeworld of humans. I don't see anybody or anything. Was this just a lie? Negative. AI is very precise. Planet is Lura. Then where is everybody? Alien life forms detected. What? How can this be? No. No. AI is analyzing planet. I don't know what to think about this. What are we going to do now? Analysis. Nuclear waste detected. Humans eradicated. Oh my gosh. What do you think of that? Humans have been eradicated. Oh my gosh. Okay. AI and um, Mimi has to do all the work, I guess. So we'll see what happens. Civilization destroyed. Now, but why? Why does this keep happening? I'll never learn about my purpose. AI should explore planet. AI can send colonists and launch rockets. AI will search for humans. AI will ask humans of Mimi's purpose. Ugh, what's the point? I'll never know anyway. Okay, AI will await Mimi's instruction. Mimi? <laughs> I thought Mimi was AI's, uh, AI's uh, what do you call it, uh, assistant? But apparently AI is like so in love with Mimi that he is like, what can I say? Okay. Mimi says, fine, if that's what you want, let's do it. Let's launch on to our final mission. Maybe I'm thinking this is the final mission because it's like the final one over here. And seems like loads of aliens are, uh, aliens are like all over the place. We do not have a lot of time, so we should get started with a few of these. Uh, I'm going to say, hmm, uh, I would love to get rid of you, but again, we don't have what we need. Uh, can we get rid of this? Can we get rid of that? Yes, we can, but not of these. Okay, we can get rid of this, which would power one, two, three stuff. And if we got, get like something else like that. Okay, yeah, I'm wasting too much time. First thing we're going to need is one of this, which is basically going to be powered over there. I'm also going to get like something like, uh, not that, over here. Uh, which is going to need a battery, obviously. Now that will need for us to have some power production going immediately as soon as possible. Generator, please, which is going to be like all the way over here, perhaps over there. No, um, because I'll need like, okay, yeah. Uh, I think I'm going to place the generator right over there, go on, uh, which is not in connection to that. I'll say go in here, maybe we'll use this and that one as well, but I don't know again. Uh, it's going to take some time, but right now we're getting this. We also need these as well, we need these as well, and we also need homes because these alien life forms will sort of get in my way. We can only get like 27 supply points, so we have to be careful how we go about this. The last episode, guys, we did not. We did not. I tell you guys again, we did not do bad. Uh, okay, we are going to go for a fabricator, which is going to produce home for us, which I definitely think we need. I'm going to place you right there, actually, right next to this, which is basically going to cover all your needs. We are going to get the home coming in. We are also going to need some extractors going. Uh, let's see. Extractor. So we need one there. We need one there. Uh, yeah, where can we get, like, both? I feel like both of you will be fine. You guys go on. If I have, like, 50... Yeah, we've got 50, so can we destroy this? Can we get something here? Ooh, okay. Um, what about this guy? How much do we have? We've got 30-something. If we destroy that one, 
Yeah, we still don't get both of them. So it's not really an... Uh, okay, yeah, I know we do need like supply and stuff. We will get there, guys. No worries, we will get there. Question is how? Uh, I think we can destroy this now. Yes, no? No, we can't because we are stuck without the resources, which we are going to get by getting... Hmm. Uh, let's get you over there. And let's get uh, you... Actually, what did I just do? Yeah, I just I didn't see this, but we had like an option right over there, which is going to be right there. We'll put like one of these and that is going to be good enough for us to produce more of this. Which should mean we should be going down over here. Yeah, that was sort of a given. Uh, which means we will sort of start off another one or maybe we should upgrade this. I have to destroy this. See if there's anything there. No, there isn't. So I'm going to place uh, another power generator which is like right over there. Okay, so I think two of these will be fine. But if not, we will sort of upgrade this one and get more things in. Uh, okay, so uh, coal is now going down. But we can always get more coal, so I'm not really worried about that. Just look at that, just another one. Uh, yeah, getting more coal coming in. Uh, obviously, we will need to upgrade this guy as soon as possible because he is our main thingy, which produces like a lot of stuff. And we are going for it as soon as we can so that we can like produce even more, which we are doing actually, so I'm not really worried about this. Should I upgrade this even further? I wonder. I mean, we don't have any issues, so I'm gonna upgrade this even further, which is very good. Now these guys are not really producing as much as needed, but this guy is producing a, like significant amounts, which is also very good. Uh, we are losing a lot of India, I think. Uh, no, we're pretty good. Like 0.12, that's fine. Uh, destroy. Okay, thank you very much. You can be destroyed. Thank you very much. And you can be destroyed. Thank you very much. Why are we destroying these? Oh, well, there's no real reason apart from I want to. Uh, okay, so there's nothing over there. We could place something in here and like connect both of them if I wanted to. I could get these guys as well. Uh, who knows? We'll see. Uh, okay, so why did I destroy all that stuff? Because again, we need a lot of stuff. Oh my gosh. Okay, you stay because you will sort of stop the uh, other things. So I'm gonna get started on this guy and I'll say give me uh, this guy right over there. Now he is actually already in range. Okay, I see. But you still need some production stuff. Now these are sort of going down significantly. What is going on? We don't have enough power. Upgrade, go on. Hopefully we will sort of get a lot more power. Okay, are we getting enough power? It's going up. That's the main thing. I'm gonna upgrade this as well. And we're gonna upgrade you and you. That way we have all the stuff that we need. Inda is now almost at capacity. So we have to be careful. This is going up. This is okay. I'm gonna say upgrade you. And that way we also do other stuff. Okay. Uh, these two are now going down. Again, you have to do this over and over again, guys. So we have to be careful. Um, okay, you are fine. I'm gonna say upgrade. Okay, so you should be going up and I need the Inder to go up as well. I think this is the Inder, so I'm going to upgrade you so that we can go up. No, we can't. Okay, this is still going down. Okay, is it Inder? Yeah, it's Inder. So I think we should really open up the possibility for another Inder production, which would be good over there. What about destroying this and that? Okay, come on, go away. Okay, that's like opened up a new area which we could totally utilize. That's like water, right? I think so. Uh, so we could use this area for more Inda if we wanted to, which I think we will eventually. It's just going to be like waiting and seeing what we can do first. Uh, okay, so uh, what else do we need for the humans? We need water and we need oxygen and we need to get rid of all that uh, pollution as well. I don't know why, but I think we do. Okay, I'm going to say go in right there. So this should take out a lot of the pollution. Uh, are we good here? We are stable. That's what we are, uh, but it's not good. Because we do need other stuff. Okay, where's the Inda stuff? Now, I think I'm gonna, I might upgrade this guy. Because we are running out of space, as you can see. we only got like a few more spaces. Okay, habitat. Uh, habitat. Give me a habitat right over here. That way we are good to go right next to this. We don't really have to place a lot of stuff. Which is also good. Because again, we've got plenty of stuff. Okay, so. Uh, this is still going down. Inda definitely needs like more production. Uh, if we sort of run out of Inda, we are screwed, seriously screwed. So I'm going to say upgrade this and we are at maximum production, but we have got this, which means we can finally get some uh, stuff. Okay, yeah, we'll see. Uh, we are obviously not going there. We need like one colonist at least. For that, I need energy, which we have. We need uh, food, oxygen and water. Well, we'll see. We've got like plenty of home, almost 1000. So 
Uh, where's the home production facility? Uh, I can't find it now. I think you... Okay, you're not supposed to be the one. Oh my gosh, yeah. We need a different thing to produce enough uh, stuff. Hmm. Now, what can we get rid of, really, in order to get this started? Okay, we've got these guys. I think I'm going to get rid of the coal thingy. Uh, yeah, we do have like two, but still. Uh, this is fine for now. We will go down. Eventually, we will be catching up too. Uh, but I need some place to produce. Uh, produces power. Produces water, oxygen, fuel. Yeah, we need this guy. Okay, so you're not connected. I'm going to say you, my friend. You need to produce water first, and then we can sort of go on the other direction as well. Yeah, we don't really have a lot of option. We have to stay and stick to what we have. I think I'm going to get rid of this guy. Okay, I know, but again, we are sort of going to push over one of you, which should give us, like, enough production, and I think that should be fine. Yeah, Hez is going down, but again, we are fine. To be honest, we are quite fine up there. If I had one over here, we would be able to supply, like, three of these, so I'd be able to take out these two. Um, hmm. Nah, it's, it's not worth it. Like, one... I mean, I'd be able to take out these two, but I'll have to put them both in. And then I'll need some place to produce more Inder, which is basically this going away, but still, it's, like, not got any of its own power source, so it's fine, I'm saying. What we really need, guys, is uh, somehow to produce one colonist, for which we're going to need some oxygen, which is what I'm going to try and do next. Oxygen, where can oxygen be produced? I believe you can produce 200 oxygen, which will basically increase my supply, which should basically increase all the other stuff. So I'm going to get rid of quite a lot of this, because we have quite a lot of the other stuff. So please and thank you. Do we not have enough power? No, we don't. So I'm going to say... Uh, upgrade you, yes please, upgrade, it should mean you are going down uh, significantly at that, if I may say so, uh, but power is going up, so once we get like enough colonists, we will be able to put in one more, yeah, I think I will be able to get like one colonist at this point, yes, very good, so our supply point went up, which means we can finally get ourselves another one of this, oof, so this is going up, this is fine, and we are good. We are good people, we are good. Okay, now, time to take out quite a lot of alien life forms. You have been destroying my life, and I'm not gonna let you. Not anymore. Uh, actually, you could have stayed. Uh, okay, destroy, destroy, destroy quite a lot. Actually, these are actually still going up, so we will have to be careful. We don't have a lot of time, as you can see. We're still struggling to get to where we are trying to go. So you are going down. I could upgrade you if I wanted to, but I'm not gonna, not yet. Um, hmm. Uh, oof. Do you see what is happening, fellas? That is just so annoying, if you ask me. I take them out and they just come back in. I don't want that happening. Go away. You too. Go away. Okay, I'm taking out a lot of you at the moment. Okay, uh, I'm not going to take out any of the small stuff because the aliens are going to like sprout out over there if I try to, so it's not probably a good idea. Uh, Saw so is good. So we could get like more humans if we wanted to. Uh, but the idea really is... We could get up to six humans here. Hmm. Uh, okay. The idea is I should get one of you. This should be able to power like three sources if we try to. So I will get you right there. Okay, you're like on that corner. And we will obviously need to get a lot of form in order to upgrade you. Which we will, I guess. But again, it's got to wait. Ooh, colonist death is imminent. Why are we not producing water, 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 water? Please and quickly. See, this is why I needed, like, another one. I keep on forgetting. I need, like, one for water, one for oxygen. Otherwise, things are going to go bad. As you can see, oxygen is going down. But once we get a second factory going... Uh, not you. Uh, where are you? Uh, did I go back? This is a factory, right? Yes, oxygen, please. Thank you. So we should see some oxygen coming up soon. Uh, actually, I need oxygen. So you two are going to go down. But again, if we upgrade you and upgrade you... We should see an increase on these sources. Okay, so that's pretty good. Uh, steel, sorry, form, which is basically steel, is going up. Which means I could upgrade you. Thank you very much. We will still need to upgrade another one. Get this done and then like launch a rocket. Because that is one of the requirements, obviously. Uh, but I'd love to get like rid of one, two, three, four. We've got like so many things that we need to get rid of. Um, yeah, we still have like 15, less than 15, like 13 minutes or so. But yeah, we'll see. Now, uh, what about other things? These are... Ooh, Indus coming down quite significantly. Why do you not have enough... Okay, I see. Uh, not enough power. Well, 
Uh, you know what to do? Destroy this. Get like one more power station going. Uh, power. There we go. Hopefully we will see some power introduction. Yeah, it's going up, but it's like insignificantly slow and low. So we have to be careful. Also, this is also going up. Now, if I upgrade this and have one over there, that should be good. Or if I take this out, we could have both of these. Yeah, I'm going to take you out. Place one over there and extract from this and that. I think that should suffice us for now. We still need like more people, as you can see, uh, because these are going to take some time. And that's sort of going down again. Upgrade uh, my days. Look at that. I upgrade this and then we lost. Uh, we lose like, like this stuff. Just enough. Just enough to make me go annoyed. Um, yeah, we need like another colonist coming in just so that we can like do a few things. Obviously, this means our capacity goes up, which means these are fine. So we can upgrade you too. Or perhaps I need to upgrade this guy, which is also producing coal. So this should go up. Now, Indus sort of got down. Upgrade you. That should mean... Okay, did I not choose... Oh, no, I chose the wrong one. Ah, damn it. Okay, upgrade you. I think I'm going to take that out and I'm going to put in like a normal one yeah i mean it is going up so we should be fine you can go down please and thank you i'm gonna get me one of you and that should be enough okay so you should be going up my friend i think so uh how about home yeah we're pretty close to almost perfect so upgrade you because again we can now you're at tier three we'll need like about 1000 liters of fuel and other stuff destroy you uh destroy you destroy yes please how much do we have we've got about or so. Hmm. Now this will actually be able to power up a lot of stuff. So okay. Uh, need about 1,000 liters of fuel. I think we've got plenty of Kada, right? Yeah. All we need is to produce some of this uh, oil, which needs to then process into fuel. Okay. Uh, which is going to be able. I mean, we will be able to get that done. Question is where? Like how much? Resource. Oh my days, look at this. This has got like plenty. We've got like plenty of open spaces for. Yeah, this is actually connected. Okay, so I think what we will do is. What is going on? Okay, yeah. So what we could do is we could get like a. Okay, I think you produce like lower. Yeah, fabricator. We've got another one coming in, which is going to produce lower at the moment. Ooh, we don't have a lot of time. We need like loads of time. Uh, okay, uh, how about electricity? Not up to there. Uh, electricity and power does come up to there, so I'm going to say go over there, the next bit, which is going to be another generator, power, no, I think I need another one for fuel. Question is, can we utilize one of you? I feel like I should upgrade you, or this is sort of uh, not enough, huh, well, uh, just my luck, isn't it? Okay, we'll see. Uh, power seems to have gone down significantly, why is that? Upgrade you, go on hoping that we will be able to do this. Coal is going down again. Oh my gosh. Okay. Uh, that should be okay. Yeah, I think that's good. I mean, obviously we could... What? Did I just upgrade this twice? I don't think so, but okay. I'm sort of missing what I was trying to do. You're supposed to produce that, but I also need you to make fuel uh, from this guy. Okay, you're going to be making fuel. That way we have all the stuff. Yes, no? Yeah, I think we're good. Uh, ob obviously, end is going down, which means we have got to upgrade you. We should push this up. Okay, everything's going up, right? Okay, power is going down instead. So what we need is upgrade you, so that we can like produce more power, and then we need to upgrade this guy as well, because we need to produce more coal for producing more power. Simple as that. Now, okay, I need one more of this actually. Uh, yeah, so you are destroyed. Hopefully, we will be able to get. This is like so easier to get. Not enough supply. Just like my luck. Uh, can I birth one more colonist? No, unless I take one out. Uh, I could upgrade this, but we don't have enough supply points for that. Okay, I mean, I'm not going to be complaining. Uh, what I need to do is take out one of you to be able to birth one more colonist, which we can do uh, because we have got plenty of food and water. Food is going down, interestingly enough, which means we immedi uh, immediately need to birth another colonist. What are you doing? Yeah, okay, sorry, guy, but you're gone. Okay, I need to upgrade this guy. Thank you. And I'm, I've got to bird someone. Question is, why can't I bird someone? Um, okay, let's go back. We don't have enough food, which is great. Okay, I need to take out something else in order to bird more colonists. Uh, I think I'm going to take out... Uh, hmm. 
Uh, we have like plenty of that. So I'm gonna say I will take out one of you who is producing water. And okay, this is very, very bad, guys, by the way, just in case you are not noticing. We need to upgrade this and then upgrade that guy. Yeah, we are about to lose this, aren't we? Hmm. Uh, I guess we will take out this guy. Yes, I'm sorry, but you've got to go. You've just got to go so that we can, like, birth one more colonist and get me. Uh, oh, sorry, I need, like, food first, don't I? Okay, so I need this to. Actually, I need this to upgrade. It should push us up for this guy as well. Hopefully we will sort of get more food coming in. I don't know. Okay, I think we will also need this to upgrade. But again, once this goes up, that is when we can get more food in. There, and that's going to take a little bit of time. Uh, do we have enough fuel? Uh, let me just see. Do we have enough fuel to get this up and running? If we do, we'll be able to take out the fuel production system completely on its own. Uh, okay, so you are producing water. What is producing fuel is my question. Uh, I think you're producing oxygen, so you are producing... Okay, yeah, you're producing this, which means you could take out this completely. Yeah, uh, let me just see one more time. Yeah, you're producing fuel. But again, we don't need any more fuel. We're good to go. Uh, so we take that out. And all I need to do is uh, upgrade you, I think. Okay, so we should be producing a little bit more of the food. And that way we could birth another colonist, I think. I don't know. Let's see. Birth. Yes, we can. So that means we will be okay going forward as we need to get more things in. Okay. We obviously need to clear out a lot of stuff, guys. But again, we are so close to being like completely broke. But we don't have a lot of time. We have like five minutes or so. Um. Okay, so water is going down. Let's just see. These are quite alright. We need to produce more water. We're producing water. Upgrade. So that we can like produce more water. Yes, thank you. So water should be going up. Food is going up. Oxygen is doing pretty low. Where is the oxygen one? Yeah, you also upgrade. That way we produce more oxygen. Uh, okay, you, my friend, if I give you like 800, will you be able to launch? We at least get one thing done. Okay, so you can launch. Tier 3 rocket gone. We need to clear out all terrain and we also need to take out uh, okay, we now need like, okay, if we can get like six of these people, hmm, now, I guess can I take this out now? I mean, I didn't need to, but I guess I want to, but again, it's gonna be tough. Destroy, 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 oh my gosh, destroy, destroy, and destroy. Okay, now that I have this area open, I think I'm gonna use this more, I'll say upgrade, so that we can like produce more food and everything. Uh, I might need like one more of this and one more of this. So you come right there, pretty small food for us, and I'd say give me, uh, sorry, one more of you right there. So we should be able to produce more food for the people that we need, and oxygen needs to go up, and we also need this one to come back in, uh, because we have the points, guys, we have the supply points. We don't have time, but we'll see. Uh, 20 minutes, that means we have like 5 minutes or so. Um, can I upgrade you, please? Thank you. Upgrade. Uh, we are good there. Upgrade you again. We are good there as well. So. Uh, what do we need? We need more water come in, and I also need more, uh, okay, you're producing home, which we have plenty of, where is the other one? I think you are producing oxygen, so you can produce more. Uh, obviously, this means these two will go down significantly, which means we could get a few more options. I think I'm going to destroy this, get a couple more options right there if I need it, which I, uh, darn, okay, show me something good, fellas, show me something good. Um, do you see what happens? Once I get these off, they just pop back in. Uh, but again, we need like more of this. I'm gonna upgrade you so that we can like up reach up to this point as well. Uh, I don't think I needed this. Uh, who knows? Anyways, let's just get more extraction going. Need this to come in, and I need another one right over there, uh, which needs some electricity, which I'm gonna put in like so, which we don't have enough points for. Just great. Birth another colonist then. Uh, because we don't have... Okay, we can birth like all the colonists if we need it, but we still need extraction. Uh, sorry, I need a power point. Uh, we still have like a little bit of time. Not enough, but still enough. Okay, so upgrade you. What am I doing? I didn't want to upgrade that guy. Ah, darn it. Okay, give me one more of you. I want to upgrade this guy. Okay, extractor upgrade. And go away. Extractor upgrade. Okay, so uh, now power is going down. We've got plenty of these, so these are going up, so these are going down as well. 
Uh, okay, so power definitely needs like one more friend, I guess. So I'm gonna say generator, go back in, and that should help us out. Okay, so we now have enough people. Uh, do we have enough home? So I'm gonna get started on destroying these because again, we will need to destroy all of these before we can say we have one. Which and uh, we've got like plenty of option to. Ooh, I think I need to upgrade this to. Yep, I forgot about that one. Uh, okay. But at least I'm sort of getting rid of all of this. Once this is cleared up, we will be able to get like all the people that we need. Which is going to be six, which we have enough room for. So you destroy. Do you see like another popping up? That's like so annoying. Okay, so you destroy. Uh, come on, destroy, destroy. Quickly, we don't have a lot of time. Let's see, destroy. Destroy. Let's see, come on people, we can totally do this. Look at that, two popped up at once. We don't want those. Okay, go away. Uh, go away. Uh, okay, we still have some time, we still have some time, we still have some time. I'm gonna say that's pretty good. That's all the cleared terrain. No, it's not. Okay, one more popped up. Good. So all terrain has been cleared, but all I need to do is get these. And we've done it! We've obtained three crits, uh, quiz, and we have obtained this within 23 minutes. You see, guys, once you sort of get into the groove of it, you sort of do pretty well, actually. So, guys, we are, have finished our mission, which means we are going to return and see what this has to say. Uh, maybe this is the end. Yes, it is. So, uh, seems like Mimi is doing something. Let's see. Oh, my days. She's going about, enjoying herself, and looking up and down, and enjoying some other stuff. Okay. Is that it, Mimi? Uh, is that the origin of your thingy, whatever you were looking for, I don't know, because you will have to tell me. Seems like, okay, they're looking at the earth, which is completely destroyed. Laura, uh, completely destroyed with alien life forms and everything. So, guys, uh, seems like this is it, though. So, I hope you enjoyed this series, if it is, uh, because it, it, it was given to me like Cookie Legends, and thank you so much Cookie Legends for giving me the game. Uh, I finished it completely. Uh, obviously because I'm so awesome, that's why it seems like there's something Mimi finds. Perhaps some artifact of some kind, who knows? I'm interested to find out what this is, so... Ooh, interesting that there's another alien. Uh, anything happening? Yes, no? I don't know, come on, show me! Mimi, don't... Oh uh, gosh. Uh, seems like that's a base that we have sort of built. A generator of sorts, perhaps? Yes, no? Ooh, interesting. Okay. Ooh, what's happening there? Another meltdown. Another nuclear meltdown, fellas. So that means we move on from there to here, which is... I think that's like the main uh, channel... Not channel art. Game art. One of the main game arts right here. Uh, I think she is gonna like plant... Like find some sort of tree or plant or something. Reminds me of Wally, actually. Hmm. And there's... Uh, AI? Is that AI? I don't know. We'll have to see. Let's see, come on. What's gonna happen? Now, this is a nice little story like Wally, if we're careful. Look at that! That's actually like similar to Wally, isn't it? Uh, is this Eva? I guess like a little bit like Eva, but that's like very similar to Wally. I need to watch that movie again actually, now that I think about it. Wally was so good. It was. Okay, let's see. I think gonna come up like a tree or plant or something. Would be interesting to see. No, apparently he just leaves. And Mimi is just sitting there. Oh no, look at that. He brought a flower for Mimi. I told you this was like Wally. Haha. -ha. Okay, there we go. Mimi, enjoy this flower, which is going to be planted now, I think. Uh, yep. Yep. And yep. <laughs> so that is a nice little love story, apparently. This is a love story. I did not know this. Uh, AI loves Mimi, that's why he does whatever he she wants, even though she is his assistant. So yeah, that's the case. Anyways, we are back on our little planet of Lura, where we are r launching a tier 3 rocket, as you can see. And we've just finished Colonial's program, fellas. Now that has been the entire game. Uh, so yeah, I mean, I enjoyed this game, seriously, a lot. And we're back onto the main screen as well. So I enjoyed this game, seriously, a lot, uh, because of the puzzle nature. Obviously, I was struggling at the beginning, but as you can see, I finished it completely. So I hope you enjoyed this uh, series as well because I sure did. So if you did, remember to like, comment, share, subscribe my, uh, to my channel as well. And also go check out Cookie Legends' Colonials program. See if you can finish the campaign on your own or load a map or make a map of your own uh, self by yourself as well. 
and you can try the challenges as well if you want to. So with that said guys, I'm going to go off, I'm going to sign off and see what is up next in the next episode, uh, which should be coming out next week I think. Um, yeah, we, we are going to start a new game obviously, but it's going to be like uh, some time before we sort of get there. Anyways, so I'm going to go off, until next time guys, it's going to be a goodbye from me Sandman Plays and remember to subscribe to my channel and I'm going to see you next time guys, so until next time, bye bye.